This is a sword fern in front of me. It's a large evergreen fern with erect fronds that form kind of a crown shape. It's abundant and widespread in moist forests throughout the Pacific Northwest, and it grows from low to middle elevations. Its family is Dryopteridaceae, and its scientific name is Polystichum munitum. Sword fern grows up to one and a half meters tall. The fronds are singly pinnate. The leaflets have a small lobe at the base pointing toward the tip of the fern. It almost looks like a little thumb. The leaflets attach to the rachis, or the stem, by a short stalk. Sword fern has large, circular sori with round indusia. Those light brown spheres are sporangia, and they are gathered in clusters called sori. The indusia are the thin, clear membranes that are covering the sori. Sword fern can be mistaken for deer fern, but deer fern tends to be smaller. The leaflets of deer fern are attached to the rachis along their whole base, not on a stalk like sword fern. Sword fern grows in medium to wet sites. Sword fern tends to grow in sites with a rich nutrient regime.